Hey everybody, King of Fire here. Welcome back to more Earthbound than the last part. Some guys rushed into the room while we were fighting the clumsy robots. It was a runaway five! <clears throat> Lucky quickly dug behind the robot. I'll flip the switch and it stopped! Oh, oh, oh geez, what a loser robot! That was so easy to stop. That was quick thinking. I don't know, I just imagine him sounding like that, I guess. I don't know which one was Louie, but... Oh well. Oh, hey, apparently the bass player is Louie. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to these guys. We would like to pay you back. We'll help you in whatever way we can. Well, you just kind of saved us from dying. So I'd say that's a pretty good payback, but I guess not. We don't have any money. We are strong, however. Let's break into the room next door. So I need to go to the bathroom first. The room next door seems suspicious somehow. Okay, well then let's go. Wait, did I talk to the yellow dude? Oh. Is that a bear? <laughs> I never... I never noticed that. I give up, I really do. Who's this old man? Wait. This bear won't attack you, he's tough. <laughs> I don't know why I found that so amusing. Anyway, this, is, if you haven't guessed, is Monotoly. Look at my skinny arms, thin body, and gray hair. I've become so weak since I lost a Manny Manny statue. I'm sorry, I kidnapped Paula. I haven't done anything to hurt her. Wait. Cute old man voice. Paula is a nice girl. Paula, return to Ness. I'm sorry I've created so much trouble for you. Oh, wait. Is this Paula talking? Ness, you finally made it here. I'm fine. I believe you'd come and save me. Mr. Monotoly isn't really a bad person. Take some time to listen to him. Man, that must sound obnoxious. <laughs> so I'm not doing that again. <clears throat> Paula joins you. I'll tell you everything, and I know I already use his voice, but it's the only old man voice I can do. The Manny Manny statue creates an illusion. It attracts evil spirits and weakens your heart. The power scared me so much I hit the statue in the warehouse at Jackie's Cafe. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words appeared to me while I was in the illusion. Ness, your name appeared in the cryptic messages. Stop Ness and do so by your own hand. Or, don't let them go to Summers. Or, make sure they know nothing of the pyramid. I don't fully understand the messages, but someone obviously doesn't want you to go to Summers. Evil Gygus or something, I could hear the name. Anyway, the evil side would be in trouble if you visit Summers. Oh, on the contrary, you should definitely go to Summers, especially because they don't want you to make it there. Would you like to hear the whole- No. Summers is located across the ocean. Take my helicopter. I'll open the door to my heliport. Is that what they call it for helicopters? Like, airplanes is airport. Is it heliport? Or did this game just make that up? Oh my gosh. Secret room. I've always wanted a secret room. This guy has one. Well, it's more of a secret staircase, but... <sighs> this is your destiny, Paul. It's time... Okay, not... Uh, yeah, but, I mean, think about it. A secret room would be so useful. I mean, you have something you don't want people to see, you just put it in your secret room. They're not going to find out about it. I mean, that one you could see because it was kind of like a graphical thing, but... I mean, real-life secret rooms aren't like that. What the heck? Am I really getting helijacked? Oh, that is so, so not cool. Well, apparently it's a bat. Oh, fat kid. You'd think that the helicopter would just plummet to the ground from the, the over amounts of weight, or the whatever. Ness, you pinhead idiot, you're just a half step too slow. I'm getting out of here. Since Monopoly has become a plain old man again, I have no more use for him. This helicopter will really come in handy. Looks like you're the world-class loser again. Well, wait a second. Helicopters take, like, training to figure out how to fly. There's no way that this little, like, probably, I don't know, like, 12, 11-year-old boy just suddenly had the ability to fly a helicopter. That doesn't happen. Pokey took the helicopter? Oh, wait. I hope he's okay. You jerk. He's on the evil side. Oh, man. I'm debating doing the... Oh, wait, no. Wait. 
I'm debating doing the woman voice right now. You know, I'm gonna go for it. Oh, well, I was a little dizzy, but now I'm okay. To get to Summers, we need to go back to three. Yep, somehow I know that's where we must go. Oh, man. Wow, you guys did a lot while I was in the bathroom. Ha 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 You want to get a three as soon as possible? We can take it to three Narctobus. I'll get the bus and wait for you just outside the building. So we have to go all the way through the building. I hate you. I'm cutting. Goodbye. Okay, real quick. I'm um, just going to grab this treasure chest. It's a vital caps. Alright, this is what I was looking for. Wait, who needs health? Okay. Okay, Paula needs health. Give to... Wait, no. Use on Paula. Okay. Hello, how are you? This is Applegood. I think I'm a real genius. In fact, I know I'm a genius. Why? Well, I've discovered the primary enemy of you and all humanity. We need... We have to fight and defeat this being. Here's what we need to invent a machine called the Phase Distorter. I've got to find the wandering scientist, Dr. Ananas, and make the distor distorter. We found him before. Whoa. Okay. Once again, cutting to out. You know, I'm just going to cut. Wait. What on earth? Yes. Okay, well. Um, I'm going to meet you at the place. At three. Or wait, no, 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 I'm sorry. Um, actually, I'm going to, um... No, we'll just resume the video from here. I'm going to, um... Cut to me being in Onet. Well, I'm going to cut, um, and I'm going to go get the sounds from Onet. And then I will meet you back here. Okay? Sound good? You sure? Okay. Goodbye. You sure? I'm sorry. Goodbye. No, oh, wait, no, we gotta get in the door bus right away. Alright, we made it. I'm sorry we couldn't do more for you. Remember, though, we're on your side. When you're having a tough time, just think of our songs and imagine Runway 5 singing somewhere far, far away. By the way, did you need to come back here? You must have forgotten some very important item or gadget here. How's that for you guys? Am I close? You don't have to tell me. See you later and good luck. Well, if that wasn't hint enough, um, we actually have to go get the, uh, spaceship thing that Jeff flew here on. So... Actually, I'm gonna go back to Ona and get the soundstone, so I'll see you when I do that. I'll meet you back here. At the graveyard. Initiate cool effect. Or transition effect. Go! Alright, and I'm back, and I do have the soundstone right here. I'll show that off later, but now we're gonna go down here to the graveyard. It's kinda creepy, I guess. I don't know, I guess that's what they were aiming for. Ooh, hey! I can't see where the problem is from the vantage point. I need to be in front. Okay, how do we do that? Oh, wait, the front of the ship. Oops. <laughs> Oh, uh, here's the problem, it's not too tough fixing off for a second or two. There, that should do it. Now if we board the Skyrunner, we'll take us back to Winters. With Dr. Ananas' help, I can modify the machine to fly Summers. If Dad, I mean Dr. Ananas is not available, I'll have to figure it out by myself anyway. Let's go back to the lab in Winters, that's it. Go machine, go. Alright, now we're gonna have another little flight scene. I'm really not sure how much time I have left. Hopefully I have enough to fit this in. Because I kind of forgot to turn on my st uh, my stopwatch thing. And... Yeah. <laughs> or, yeah, my like... Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. So I'm really not too sure how much time I have recorded, but... I'm guessing around nine minutes. If I don't... If, um... Blah, 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 blah. If I don't have enough recorded, then I'm just gonna, um, or if I have too much recorded, I'll just put it into two parts. Shouldn't be that bad. Anyway, there was a present we missed. Oh, well, it's probably, it probably is something good. I'm not gonna jinx myself by saying that. Get on the little dive scene, because we just love to show off. Oh, hey, look, we're on four side. Wait a second, is that taking that long bus drive to three? Can we just have teleported? Yeah, 
uh, obviously a flaw in the programmer's ability to do create not make plot holes. Anyway, now we arrive here at the lab, but um Ooh, hey look. Bubbles and his woman friend. Wait, what's that monkey's name? Bubbles? Oh, did it have a name? Thanks for taking care of my husband the other day. Oh yes, we finally tied the knot. Honey, don't just stand there with your mouth open and say hello. So, you pass by a cave north of Stone Edge. Don't you ever wonder what's inside? Can't seem to stop thinking about it. Go and see what's there. We're going to get out of here. We're still new to you now. Bye-bye. Okay, well, we are out of time for this video. If you like it, comment, rate, subscribe. I will see you in the next part where we modify the ship and head to Summers. Goodbye.